Repair Clinic makes fixing things easy. With millions of replacement parts available on our website and the help you need to do the repair yourself. Since we encourage you to perform this repair safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. Before you replace the vent pipe assembly in your washer, be sure to unplug the power cord. Using a T20 Torx bit or a quarter inch socket or nut driver, unthread the screws securing the rear access panel. Loosen the center top screw, but don't remove it. Now slide the panel to the right to remove and set it aside. Next, unthread the rear screws securing the top panel. Slide the top panel back and lift up to remove. Pull the vent hose off of the vent housing then use a T20 Torx bit to unthread the screws securing the vent housing. Lift the housing up to remove. Unthread the lower screw securing the vent pipe assembly. Loosen the upper screw. Use a flathead screwdriver to help pry the pipe assembly free of the tub. Release the clamp securing the steam hose and pull the steam hose off to fully release the old pipe assembly. Prepare the new vent pipe assembly for installation by transferring the mounting bracket from the old pipe to the new one. Attach the steam hose to the new pipe and secure it with the clamp. Align the pipe on the upper screw as you insert the pipe into the tub port. Tighten the upper screw. Replace the lower screw. Replace the vent housing and secure it with the screws. Slide on the vent hose. Realign the top panel and slide it into position. Replace the screws in the rear. Hook the rear access panel on the top screw and slide it to the left. Tighten the screw. Rethread and tighten the remaining mounting screws. With the repair completed, plug the power cord back in, and your washer should be ready for use. At Repair Clinic, we make fixing things easy. Thank you for supporting the production of these videos by purchasing your parts from our website.